Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I'll be going to the market today and here is my list. These are the things I need to buy and um, yes, I'll be going to the market and the total of what I want to buy is around 8,500 Naira. I don't know if this is going to be enough or if I'm going to have to buy more. But of course, you know Nigeria now, of course, so there is no way you can actually work with the list you have you must either buy more and stuff like that so but i mean i'm going to try to keep to this amount yeah so i have my money my new money this is now the the, the gates to heaven without the new currency you can't buy anything you practically won't be able to eat in fact this is i don't even know what this is now so uh plus and minus i have around nine thousand naira cash with me and um like i think around 9200 or around 8200 naira with me so guys i'm going to actually just add my card to that because i don't know how things will be so i put my my card in my purse just in case of emergency but this card was just as useless because i didn't find anywhere to withdraw and then of course my cash i also put in my bag i made a mistake because i this is the last cash that i have but i spent everything in this market and i was been looking for more money so guys i'm ready let's hit the market good morning how much for this one three thousand so guys at this point uh, it dawned on me that i was up for a very long long stuff like the price of everything in this market was just out of range you know this guy insisted that for one piece of a fish, I should be paying 700 Naira. And in my list, I have um, 1,000 Naira for dry fish. But then, um, I mean, I don't want to pick just one piece of fish for 1,000 Naira. So, um, this didn't work with this particular seller. So, I had to leave. I had to try somewhere else. so at this port it wasn't any cheaper though but i was able to get something reasonable that my money could afford that was just the difference well um at this point i had to make a choice i had to choose the one of them um, i had to choose fish of 1000 naira, and i took just the one that has two pieces and one of the traders there told me that the one that has two pieces was actually better. Well, I actually demanded something that was um, more dried than the one she was trying to give me. So yeah, I got something that was better off in terms of um, dryness. And yeah, that was it. So I made my choice. I selected this one two hundred. You won't sell for me. I never even decide you don't bring nylon. Abby. <laughs> Make I take one three hundred, okay, and then one two hundred. Abi, one the five hundred. Abi, buy it for me. So for more cases settled, I bought what I budgeted in my list. I like to add that I'm not getting the face of the people I'm buying things from because I mean I really don't think it's nice to make videos of people without their consent Abacado, nah, how much? you don't stop ah. you never stop you never stop the man like this you're just strong you never be okay so this is how much how many a one i want so guys next time um, i was able to buy avocado the avocado was um 
kind of expensive it was i got that one for 200 naira i don't know if that's the range of avocado or if that's um i don't know i've not been really buying avocado so i can't tell but i mean when the woman was like okay 200 you know i didn't want to keep on going back and forth with her i mean that's not even the nice or the right thing to do so i just took um i just took that i also went ahead to buy cucumber i didn't plan for cucumber i didn't put cucumber in my list but seeing it displayed here and then i mean it's something that i love to eat because it's quite healthy i just fell for the temptation and i got cucumber as well although i didn't plan for it initially i did not stop there oh. i didn't stop at the cucumber i started pricing sir soap at some point you know the woman called them gave me a very high price and i had to remind myself that i don't have all of these in my list and that i'm supposed to stick to the list that i have so the list i've made because i mean there's no money you cannot use your car how many money how much did they sell out? Like? no no so this one i know what it's under there so this guy is selling this aku or banga or um, this guy gave me say so uh at in fact the guy was his his temper was and everything was really high you know i eventually asked him to give me for 500 naira which he did but the size he gave me for 500 naira was really small so i actually asked him to add more to make it 800 i wanted him to even measure the mudu but the guy just scooped something and added and then later on he told me that uh, what i have is for 700 that he added 200 naira extra so yeah i paid him so guys at this point my camera became really hot and stopped recording so um i had to buy other things off camera when i got home my head was spinning it was a very very long and a very busy day but in all i bought you know reasonable stuff i didn't buy everything i wanted but i bought most of the things i wanted so of course you saw me buying the meat the fish the pomo the panga or the aqua so i bought a the kokuyam i bought ukazi i bought ugu that's my vegetables i bought isam my periwinkle i bought crayfish and i bought i still later bought oboroko and my seasonings so guys i i of course you saw me buying cucumber and avocado i later on bought strawberry i bought beetroot i bought um carrots i bought coconut and i bought odara guys it was a very stressful day i am cashless now but i am going to eat well this weekend i wasn't able to buy a lot of things in that my list were well, like i could not even venture going close to to snail that one is for bilonia oneji kashi so i just avoided them when i heard them from afar calling huge prizes we've come to the end of today's video thanks for watching till this point please subscribe if you haven't and i'll see you in my next video have a lovely time